Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to show you how you can hide the sync button from OneDrive uh, app. Uh, let me explain to you the situation, the use case. So uh, what I'm talking about is this. If you navigate to your OneDrive account, of course, OneDrive for Business is your personal um, you know, account uh, under the company you work for um, that allows you to store your um, you know, kind of um, private files and folders. Um, it also has the sync button, right? Just like a document library, if I navigate, let's say, on a given SharePoint site, we have a, library, a sync button on each library that allows me to synchronize the entire library to my computer. I can do the same with my OneDrive. And essentially, the feature I'm about to show you allows me to disable the sync button. Uh, let me show you how. Um, you obviously need to be an admin to do that. So I'm going to navigate to the admin center, SharePoint admin center. And then under settings, uh, right here, all right, at the bottom, all the way at the bottom, OneDrive sync, uh, you can click and you can uncheck the box, all right? So just like that, all right, it says show the sync button on the OneDrive website. You just uncheck the button and click save. Let's pretend I did this. I really don't want to disable this uh, button, uh, but uh, let's pretend I uncheck the box and click save. Uh, it usually takes about 20 minutes uh, or so, but uh, this button will be gone. All right, this button will be gone, so you no longer can, uh, you know, the users will no longer be able to sync uh, the OneDrive essentially files and folders. Uh, one very important thing, though, uh, to to remember and be aware of is that this checkbox does not get rid of the sync button on the libraries, so it will get rid of it on your OneDrive. Um, you know, website, right? Uh, but it's not going to, um, you know, to, to be disabled here, all right? It's still going to appear and the users will still be able to synchronize SharePoint libraries to their computer. Uh, there is a way to uh, make this button disappear as well. Um, however, um, there is a, just another technique you need to use. Uh, I actually recorded um, a few videos on that. You can find them on my YouTube channel, how to, um, you know, disable the sync on, um, essential on SharePoint document libraries. But if you want to disable the sync on uh, OneDrive, just, you know, again, make sure to navigate to the admin center and uncheck that box, right? So that's all I really wanted to show you in this video. Hopefully you learned something new. As always, happy to see you on my blog, sharepointmaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.